will review the DFM Pro functions embedded inside of NX Checkmate application. In this non-parametric machine part, we will use Prismatic Check to analyze this data. We see that there are several errors in our Checkmate results. Using NX See Through All command, we can see clearly the locations of internal features within this machine part. The first check identifies a deep hole check where the aspect ratio of the height versus the diameter of the hole exceeds the standard. In the DFM Pro Rule Manager, we see that the industry standards that are in place. Using NX see-through capability, we can quickly visualize one of the deep hole air feature. If the hole depth is too deep and the diameter is too small, and in many cases, this will cause the tool to break. Next to the hole, we see that the tool accessibility error we see that there's a geometry covering the hole and there's no way to gain access to drill that hole. Another error that DFM Pro has identified is from sharp corner in the pocket of this machine part. In reviewing the DFM Pro help page, manufacturer recommendations are made to avoid additional cost of using ATM. If it's not so critical to have a sharp internal corner, design engineer can quickly add a fillet or have a hole to be drilled first and then mill the pocket to resolve this issue. DFM for sheet metal quickly identified a hole features too small. In a standard sheet metal practice, the hole must be at least equal to the thickness of the part. Another common check is a knife edge condition. This is considered to be a safety constraint. This exterior edge could lead to possibly injury or part failure. In DFM Pro injection molding checks, a thin steel condition is noted. When two of the plastic walls are too close together, in turn affects the tooling where the core and the cavity walls are very thin, and this ultimately affects the tool life in the plastic injection mold parts. In this assembly check, we will review the tool reach or fastener accessibility. The geometry of the component part is going to interfere with the tool which will be used for assemble or disassemble the fastener below. In a complex assemblies, identification of such interference area is very difficult to detect. Let's take a look at the hole alignment rule violation. The hole on these two components are not lined up correctly. Minor misalignment of holes will result in issue related to joining. Fasteners may not fit correctly. Again, this is usually not found until at the assembly operations or out on the shop floor. DFM Pro has a variety out-of-the-box rules, and users can add more company best practices rules into this tool for implementation. Thank you.